Hey everyone, Heavy Metal here. I'm sorry you can't see my crop face is up cropped, but anyways, if the video ends early, make sure you guys hit the subscribe button, turn on the notifications. But let's get right into it. Now today, I got really something cool today, and that is of course a collector's item. Oh, I'm sorry. And that is of course serial serial killer's big kid um, coloring book. Now this is a collector's item. I never even um color it so that's why it's left it all blank like this now it has some really cool color killers i like um R richie Rim richie ramirez um jeffrey dahmer's in there um ed gain okay here um, ed gain uh ed kemper that's i don't know what else is there and it's also considered a collector's item collector's item but well, it's not mine it's my stepdad's but but my niece right there she left um t took it and my stepdad got all mad for it as well i was like dude if you, you get mad over something that you want just buy another one but you just want to complain over it now we had it for about two years now um we never really did i'm gonna have to put it in a frame and put it in a frame yeah, put it in a frame and then just like leave it hanging on my wall. But this also considers a contains adult content. I was like, how is it adult content if it's well only like that as well? Only the only a little bit of it. But it's like how is it adult content if you only if it's only single? Also, yeah, that's pretty much. What and it also tells about the years and the age and the, the birth months. Like, like how they did, for example, Ed Gain. Well, his full name was Edward Edward Theodore Gain. Was born in, in um August August twenty seven, nineteen oh six, and died on July twenty sixth, nineteen eighty four. So I mean, some of these killers are still alive, but they just given up. Like Ed Kemper, Ed Kemper was from. Born on December 18th, 1948. But he's, but that, that person's still alive, unless, unless that person, unless that person died. So, um, yeah. That's pretty much what happens. That most of the. So, um, yeah, that's what happened. But, but yeah, I was like, how is this a, considered a collector's item if it's not, like, drawn or anything like that? Yeah, it has to be drawn before, um. Um, it ha before you have to draw it before it's considered to be a collector's item. <sighs> so, any conclusions? But yeah, it has considered different colors. There is this one, the color version of Nanny Downs, or I don't know how you say her name, but but yeah, that's this one that has color of the front. But I don't know how many pages are in here. It doesn't say how much it is. Uh, oh, 37 single slide of pages contains adult content or whatever. No, whatever. But, but yeah, basically that's the... I have another one, like something like this, that's called Def, Def World Records. I mean, I don't have it with me. I only have this one I'm going to show you guys in the, in the next video. But, but yeah, when during the video, it's, it's going to be slightly like this because my phone is on, like, it's like on, it's like, like, not like that, but like this. I mean, like all the random crap I just, we have on here, but yeah, basically that's the this is the book, the well, coloring book, and, and that's why it's considered a big kid coloring book. After it just says contains adult content, adult content. It was made by a guy named K. Shaver. I'm not how you say. <sighs> Sorry, but it's just. But yeah, basically, I mean, where I got this from, it was from, it was my stepdad's, um, yeah, it was my stepdad's coloring book. He got it from, from someone from at his work that they don't want anymore, so they just give it to him. And that's, that's why it was considered a collector's item. So, yeah, that's pretty much what happened. Like, I also, another example who passed away was, of course, who does not know... 
I don't know. Zodiac killer. have some really cool names like the gorilla killer it was like not cool that and then we have the another brother we have another serial killers that was the the west the west, west rosemary west and fred west but i think there one is still alive i see one that passed away one that died fred west was born on the was born on september 29th 1941 and then died on, on New Year's Day that was January January 1st, 1995. And Rosemary West was born on um, November 29th, 1953. I guess Fred West was a lot older at the time. Like, another really cool character. Another really ki cool killer. Well, another cool killer was, of course, Lizzie Borden. Lizzie Borden knows, but yeah, that's pretty much cool. Oh, uh, what happened? Yeah, I'm trying to like watch it to try to figure out the place. But yeah, some of these killers has inspiration for the iconic horror characters besides Ed Gain. There's of course, um, of course, John Wayne Gacy for um, Pennywise as well. Of course, there's another. Yeah, hold on. Of course, like I said, a game. I'm pretty sure if you, I'm pretty sure you, you heard, pretty sure some of you heard it, some of you don't hear it. But let me explain, tell you guys about who this guy inspiration for. If you, if you are like I said, if you know where the inspiration did come from from this guy, you guys will know what I'm talking about. If you, on the other hand, if you don't know what the inspiration from this guy is, Ed Gain, Edward Dieter Gain got in, was inspiration. Came inspiration for Leatherface, the Tex well, Texas Chainsaw Massacre, Norman Bates, Norman Bates, Buffalo Bill from Times of the Lambs. On like, I'm pretty sure another clown killer besides, well, of course John Wayne Gacy. John Wayne Gacy also the inspiration of another killer besides Pennywise is of course Twisty the Clown from American War Story. I'm pretty sure there's more killers that in got inspiration for iconic horror characters today. But yeah, that's what I. Anyway, guys, so um, I mean, this is the last review of the of the of the book, the coloring book, and then the, the last time of the back as well. So yeah, guys, that's pretty much. It. Anyway, guys, so. That's all I got you from, to this topic. If you like my content, make sure you guys hit, hit that subscribe button, turn on notifications, and see you guys in my next video. Until then, guys, goodbye. And that also, I just want to say, my next video is going to be another coloring book that was the death row before I go somewhere. But anyway, guys, talk to you soon. Make sure you guys hit the subscribe button, turn on notifications, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Until then, guys, goodbye.